Hello, friends. Welcome back to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries, Heroes of the Inner Sphere. So we are hanging out in an industrial hub right now, and we're going to get the hopper a little bit better than it was. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop a couple of single heat sinks, and we're going to get four doubles in there. And then we got some short burst lasers that we're going to throw in here. And we have just enough to get it done. And I will be keeping my eye out for some better medium short bursts. And we got one more single heat sink we can throw in here. And that gets our cooling up to... Hmm, I think we can go even better. We'll get two more doubles in here. And we will bring even more cooling to the table. So we're up to a three. And the, um, the heat generated by the short burst is actually a lot better. See, we're 4.1 on the short burst large, whereas the regular large, we're 7.5. So we're going to be firing faster. We're going to be um, cooling better. It is going to cost us 81 days to get this thing working, but we're going to be in good shape. So, no good pilots here. And we are going to check out Kestrel, though, with the rare mech and the cantina, so we can pick up a couple extra jobs. So that we can build up our career paths. As well as, not, I wouldn't say waste the time, but we need to spend some of that time we might as well do some things. Well, it's just an assassin. Crab, Shadowhawk, nice mech to have. Thunderbolt, always, always a good mech to have in your back pocket. A nice 65 tonner, plenty of armor, decent um, weapon loadout. It's actually a nice all around mech. Big fan of these guys. See what we have in equipment. See, I see a short burst large. Anything in mediums? No. Unfortunate. Typical stuff here, nothing there. All right, everything is looking pretty good. I'm going to pick up a couple of these AC-10 burst fires just in case we need to slap something on our, <clears throat> excuse me, our um, enforcer. Take a look at the barracks. Those are ours. Got a 38 here. 22 of 38, and he would be replacing probably Captain Tucker. So we drop back a little bit on what we have here, but I think it's worth it. Ooh, does not have good dodge. So f his defensive skills are not great. I think it's, honestly, I don't know that it's worth it. Well, he does, he may not dodge, but he does take reduced damage at a much better rate. And he's got the better, you know what? I think we will do it. Finally. Got My combat skills are meant to impress, sir. So we will get that guy in our lance and we'll get him leveling up. 
Uh, the mech market was not great. I am wondering if it might be worth it to grab the Thunderbolt. Let's see, kill three spiders. Kill five Igors. Collect Jump Jets Class 3. Let's go for it. I think we're falling a little bit... Yeah, we haven't even gotten much with the Equipment Collector. So let's start working on that so we can build that up. Tier 1 armor, good to have. And the shorter late burn time on the lasers, very nice. Also, weapon cooldown. Very good stuff. Alright, it's just a few more guys to get fixed up. And we'll be going back into the Apex Mining Syndicate. Since that's really right in our wheelhouse right now as far as the difficulty levels. This one's a little low. So we could actually coming up here to the Davian Karita front lines. This is good. This is good. Uses up a lot of our downtime. Ancient Star League garrisons. Ooh. Sounds like it might have some good stuff there. But we want to get this grasshopper on the battlefield and see how it's working. Let's see. We have ourselves frontline support for Davian or Karita. I think we're going to go for Davian here because we have much better reputation with them. That gives us a much better chance to get the goods from them. Selling the Chaja. This is the 1A1. This one is, in my opinion, a pile of hot trash. You're looking at five short burst small lasers. It's got speed. It's got armor. But it's not going to do a whole lot as far as firepower. It's basically a light mech killer, pretty much. And you've got your 81 kph. It's really good speed for an assault mech but it's just not really worth it all right so we have a raid and a demolition for our high stakes let's get it done 230 tons looks good to me we get nine negotiation points Giving us up to 21 salvage and one and a, almost one and a half million sea bills. I think we will drop that down. We're going to take two airstrikes. Because we do have the raid. They actually uh, work out pretty nice. Wow, this is... <laughs> That's really good. All right, so it was salvage, it was airstrikes, and we'll take the last one into sea bills, and let's go. All right, we are ready. We are ready. No, we're ready in 20 days. Oh, grasshopper is good to go. Should check the, um, the weapons groups, make sure that they've gone back where they really right. where I really want them to be for the Davion forces to mount their assault yep everything looks good in the middle of the fray. instead we'll need to take out the curious and comms network remember though this is an active war zone so stay frosty all right has been granted commander approach the target area to call them in Tango down. Let's see what we can do here. Come on. Target is down. Target 
Hey, buddy. Focus fire on commander's target. Yeah, our uh, our heat problems are pretty much gone now. There we go. Let's go. Yeah, the cooldown is much better. Good work, Commander. That's one less target. Target Enemy destroyed. We can definitely take the heat here. Target acquired. Target destroyed. Thank you, boys. Some stuff swanning around all the way down there. And we are not hitting it. This never gets old. Jump right. jet fuel flow. Jump jet fuel Let's empty. get up. Let's get down on this guy. Target neutralized. Goodbye. Yeah, uh, guys, we're going back the other way again. Oh, it seems a shame. They finally figured out how to get up there and... Oh, hello. Goodbye. You say goodbye and I say hello. I do like these I do like this belt, I gotta say. Nearly there, Commander. Approach the hidden object to pick it up. Oh hello. Oh, there it is. That's close enough. Yeah, give Ready me salvage. Pick up operation. Package acquired. Target destroyed. All right, there goes Enemy that. Ship. Landing at your location. Ooh, that hurt. That hurt. Enemy get that off of him. Yes, please. Thank you. Um, hello! Okay, that worked. It is just a hot mess here right now. Go, you're done. Can we kill that one, please? Let's get that arm off of him and call it a day. Yep, he's going to be... Uh... Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. There we go. Alright, so long and tanks for all the fish. Uh, that was not the explosion that I thought it was. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, we got the light that time. There's something in the air. No, it's an AC2 turret. Target neutralized. Was an AC2 turret. All right, airstrikes. Got to remember to use the airstrikes. I mean, we got them. We might as well be using them, right? Right? Am I right? Am I right? Yeah, it would be pretty fair to say that we might actually be overcooling this mech right now. So it might be worth it to take the doubles off and put the singles back in so we can focus everything into the torso and really leave the arms as a shield. Alright, so this is our next target. I hate Hellstorm. did some damage over there. We definitely did some damage there. That was a good airstrike. You gotta go. That's a manticore, you gotta go. I'll take the tanks, boys. You guys deal with everything else. There goes the arm. Let's try to get the, uh, the auto cannon off of him. There we go. Target down. There goes that. And you are just a hot mess. Just because. Why? Because we can. Sierra 1 1, this is Sierra 2 1. Coordinates is confirmed. Sierra 2 1, out. All right, we're out of here. Vindy, not looking good. Lost a large laser, buddy. Hmm. Flyer in the air. There we go. Get dunked on. Ooh, that torso not looking good. Let's go. We're moving on out, folks. Moving on out. All right. Not too bad. I mean, Vindicator's going to need a bit of work. We need a bit of work. Can we get to it in time? It'll take them quite some time to get it back up and running. It looks like we've provided the Davion forces a good window of time to mount their invasion. Nailed it. Excellent find, Commander. Beginning <laughs> there we go. Now. Wonder what we got. 
thinking more about getting rid of that turret than I was about what we'd picked up, but we'll see it on the salvage screen. Always nice. AC-10, Tier 1. Not bad. Let's see, so we can pick a Blackjack, we can pick a Jenner, we can pick a Hunch. I mean, a Hunch is a nice pickup. Gives us a little bit of... Might be a better choice than our good buddy, the, um, the Enforcer. Because this guy can carry quite a bit more as far as punch. Um, we also have more salvage than that, so we can take that. There's nothing here we actually need to pick up. So let's grab one of the Irbies for some money. And yeah, let's take the LRM-10. All right. Not too bad. I mean, we took a bunch of damage. Vindy's going to be a little costly. Vindy is definitely going to be a little costly, but let's see what it's going to run. Needs a large laser. We got 20 days. Ooh, that's that's harsh. Just the 26 days there is a little harsh. So this costs us 64 days in round trip. No, we do have to go back to Misery, which is probably a little bit... I think this is going to be worth it. Because what I'm thinking about is I'm thinking about upgrades. And I'm definitely thinking about upgrades on um, the Grasshopper. And upgrades work just like everything else. Uh, Irby, goodbye. So let's take a look. Assassin, Griffin, Locust, nothing Grim's comes commander. to mind. Nobody great for pilots. All right. Single heat sinks. Since we're overcooling here, We're going to go back a little bit. Just little little things that we can do to just kind of optimize a little bit better. And upgrade-wise, we've got eight slots we can throw in here. Fortified structure, always looking good. Uh, faster cooling... Jump jet, target locks, that is... Uh, faster cooling. I mean, it's a, it's a price tag. The downside of this is it's actually going to go in after. everything that we're doing on on the mech so all of our I mean we're still gonna do it see completion of loadout work order so our repairs go first and then the upgrades large laser uh, large laser repairs start that Uh, you just need repairs. 
you just need repairs. Now let's take a look at the Hunchback. Actually a big fan of having ammo in the legs. We I mean this could be a thing. Gauss rifle? <laughs> Gauss rifle anyone? Um, why not? Uh, three tons of Gauss ammo? I don't think we'll need we can drop the small laser. I don't think we need all of the heat sinks. Well, let's see. Let's go one, two, two mediums. Hmm. We've got about a half a ton. I would throw a small laser in the head. Make it just under 50. I think we're going to spread the Gauss ammo around just in case something happens. You know what? Double Gauss. This Gauss is volatile, so it's not going to explode and blow us up. So you can put it wherever you want. We'll slap that in the center torso. The two heat sinks are just fine. We'll leave those in the legs. Let's go. Gauss Hunchback. Sounds like fun. Alright. It is a lot of time and investment to make the repairs, but I think it'll be just fine. And how are we on jobs? We are six of six on jobs. We still need to kill four more Igors. We're not seeing griffins, spiders. I do believe we are in the right area for no, we're in the wrong area for the MWIO. So that was this area. Yeah. Now back to misery is another 27 days. And we are going to be waiting. All right, 27 days. So we got the refit on the hopper. Now we're waiting on the upgrades. So once those are complete, the hopper will be ready to go. And it's going to be interesting to see how that works out. So we're still 43 more days. We are going to get slapped with the financials if we wait. This is a demolition. Um, two? All the money? And a little bit of salvage? Yeah, works for me. So instead of bringing the grasshopper, we can bring the dervish, the vindicator. Hmm. Yeah, we're only a little bit under tonnage here. It's not a big deal. So let's have some SRM fun. Actually, we haven't played the Enforcer in a while. You know what? I'm going to play the Enforcer. Because we haven't done that in a while. We could stand to train our ballistics a bit. You can get the Dervish. Lieutenant Harms can take the Vindy. And we'll leave Captain Tucker. Who's our... Captain Tucker's our low guy here. We do have Suggs. And I would like to start building him up since he is a higher tier pilot. And I think this works for him. And he doesn't need much evasion in the Jaeger. He's going to be on the back lines. So let's go. All right. We'll get in. We're going to play a little 
a uh, little bit of the enforcer, see how that guy's running. Get a little uh, auto cannon play. And let's see how it goes. All right, so what are our seems like it isn't just the federated sons that are hiring mercenaries to battle it out on the front line. Uh. The combine is employing a merc group to do run and gun raids on Davion supply lines. We need to take out these mercenaries to alleviate pressure on the Davion forces. All right, let's get in there. We're about a little under two kilometers, and we're just gonna bomb this from about as far away as we can get hopefully it's a nice concentrated base not so sure hard to yeah it looks like it is spread out Hey boys! Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're making progress, but still have a long way to go. Keep at it, everyone. Really? I'm showing heavy damage to a number of the facility structures. We appear to be. That's more like it. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about right there. That is slung just a little bit lower than I expected it to be. Let's get that, um... Guys, get that. Break that thing, please. I take this guy out. There you go. Uh, what's this? That's a scorpion. Looks like somebody headshot him. Go, you are on the floor. Oh, Panther. Okay. Looks like the Dervish is losing bits again. Mech down, boys. Alright, there goes the PPC. There goes the SRMs. <laughs> that was, uh, that was fun. Ouch. 
Alright guys, um, deal with that please. Since I don't have anything left in my uh, center torso here. Alright, and there is that. Now we can get out of here. Alright. Damn it! How about some support over here? Get out of here. Did we get the locust or not? Who knows? Okay. Well, I'm still not happy with the torso armor of the enforcer. It seems to uh, disappear very quickly. Uh, unfortunately, champion's on the board, but we can't take it. But we'll grab the money. Go on, take the money and run. And grab those short burst mediums so we have some backups of them. Wakefield did very good damage there. Alright. And we get a Panther. Who cares? Alright. I think that'll do it. I hope everyone enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget the three S's. Smash it, share it, and sub it. Smash that like button. Share it with your friends. Subscribe for more. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified every time a video goes live. And we'll see you in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.